Hi, boys and girls. So today when we practice our words, we're going to do something brand new that we've never done before. So I'm going to teach you something new that you need to learn about. And we're going to use these six words to help us. So let's just review our words. First, we have was, next, that, our, don't, and want. And so you notice up across the top of my paper, I have the ABCs. So you're going to need your journal. You're going to need your pencil. Do not go and try and write all these ABCs up at the top of your journal. You will just look up here at my screen when we reference our ABCs. Do not go and write those at the top. Just get your pencil and your journal and then come back and hit play. Okay, so we are going to practice something called ABC order or alphabetical order. And that means putting our words in order of how the letters are in the alphabet. And so to do this, first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to focus only on the first letter of each of these words. Okay, so right now you're just watching. You don't need to write anything on your journal yet. So I'm circling the first letter of the word was, the first letter of the word next, the first letter of that, our, don't, and want. So I've got the first letter of every word, word circled because that's how we're going to get started. And so I'm going to look at my alphabet. And the first letter of the alphabet, of course, is A. So I'm only focusing on my circled letters. I'm going to look to see if I have any words that start with A. And I do not. Okay, so I'm going to go to my next letter, B. I'm going to look to see do I have anything that starts with a B. And I don't. This is a D, not a B. Okay, my next letter is a C. So I'm checking to see do I have any letter that starts with a C. Nope. D. And yes, right here, the word don't starts with a D. So that's going to be our first word on our list. So now you can go ahead and pick up your pencil and you're going to put the word don't because if we're going to write these words in the order of the alphabet, don't would be our first word because we don't have any words that start with an A, B, C, or D, or I mean A, B, or C, but we do have a word that starts with D and it's don't. Okay, and I'm going to just go ahead and cross this word off of our list because we don't even need to worry about looking at that D anymore. Okay, so I'm going to pick up where I left off with my alphabet and I was on D, so I'm looking at the letter E. Now I have a word that has an E in it, but it's not the first letter. We're focusing only on the first letter. And I don't see anyone that starts with an E, so I'm going to keep going. F. Check to see if you see any word that starts with an F. Nope. G. So I'm just going to keep going. Nope, nothing starts with a G. H. Nope, nothing starts with an H. This has an H in it, but it's not the first letter. I. Nope. Anything with a J. No J. K. Now there's a shortcut that we could do when we're doing ABC order, but since this is the first time, we're just going to kind of do the long way. And later on as we do it more and get better at it, I'll teach you a shortcut. Nothing with an L. No words that start with an M. N. Oh, right here. I've got this word that starts with an N. So that's our word next. So underneath my first word, I'm going to put next because in alphabetical order, next would be the word that would come after don't. Okay, and then I'm going to cross off next because we don't even need to worry about that word anymore when we're looking for our letters. So that one's off our list. Okay, so right now you should have in your journal the word don't and next. So I'm going to pick up where I left off. I was on the letter N. So I'm going to continue with O. And I see right there, I do have a letter that starts with O, or excuse me, a word that starts with the letter O, and it's the word hour. So I know that's going to come next on my list. So go ahead and pick up your pencil and write the word hour. And then I can cross it off. We don't need that anymore. Okay, and then we're going to continue on with our list. We were on O. So check to see, anything with a P at the beginning? Nope. Q. 
Nope. R. No R. S. Nothing that starts with S. T. There we see the word that starts with a T, so we're going to go ahead and put T H A T, the word that. So that's our next word that comes in alphabetical order. And then I can cross off the word that. And then I don't really even need to look through U and V because all I have left now are words that start with a W. Nothing with a U, nothing with a V. But yes, I do have words with W, and this is where it's a little tricky right now. We have two words that start with W. So I'm gonna have to look at the second letter. And they both start with this, or have, both have the same second letter. So now I have to look at the third letter. Okay, so right now I'm looking at the S, and I'm looking at the N. And so I have to figure out which one of those letters comes first in the alphabet, S or N. And I see N is right here, and S is right here. So I know N comes first. So I'm going to take this word down here that has the N in it, since they both start with the same two letters. So I'm gonna put W, oops, A, N, T, want, and then I can cross that off. And then I'll put my other W word underneath. So when we have letters or words that start with the same letters, we kind of have to go deeper into the word and we'll get more practice with that as well as we do more ABC order. Okay, but now I can see I have my words in alphabetical order. They're going in the order of the alphabet, focusing on the first letter. So I can look and I can see, okay, so my first word started with a D, so D was first, and then N, and so I'm going right down the alphabet, and then I have the O, and then I have the T, and then I have my two W words, where we had to kind of go a little bit farther in the word to figure out which one came first. So don't next hour that, want, and was, and that's how we do ABC order, and we will do practice um, probably next several weeks with ABC order so you can get really good at understanding it.